It's the hottest dish in the streets. It's what everyone's talking about on Facebook. Twitters and Facebooks and all that stuff. It's time for Big Tigger's Trending Topics. Yeah, that's trending topics. On V103. Time for the Trending Topics, ladies and gentlemen. The 411 and all your favorite folks. And apparently all the celebrities are doing it. It's a, it's a trend. What is it that they're doing? Get naked. Let me explain. Over the weekend, Gabrielle Union exposed online. Her and her NBA husband, Dwayne Wade, are asking the FBI to step up efforts in tracking down these apparent hackers who have gone wild. Posted topless pictures of the actress and others online this weekend. Union and Wade appear to confirm the photos are indeed of the Union. The 41-year-old actress says private moments shared and deleted solely between her and Wade have been leaked by vultures. She described it as another example of widespread victimization of women and children worldwide. Additionally, Megan Good also blasted hackers in an expletive-filled Instagram post on Sunday, saying her pictures were for her husband's eyes only. Union and Good appear to be among the second wave of celebrities targeted in another massive nude photo leak Saturday. The latest, which follows a similar incident three weeks ago, reportedly included photos of Kim Kardashian, Rihanna, uh, Vanessa Hudgens and soccer star Hope Solo. The FBI has been investigating the invasion of personal accounts believed to be connected with Apple's iCloud service. We'll keep you posted as it develops. Now, Alicia Keys also seen on Instagram in the nude, but for a whole different reason. Pregnant singer has posted a revealing new photo on Instagram to raise awareness about the issues in her new single, We Are Here. She's shown posing nude from the hips up with only a white peace symbol painted on her belly. In the caption, she encourages followers to become part of a new social media campaign in which users take photos holding up written statements about making a difference beginning with the phrase, We are here. Pharrell, Kelly Rowland, and J-Lo among the famous faces that have taken part so far. She also performed a new single over the weekend and was also a part of um, a really, really awesome all-star memorial for the late actress and activist Ruby D. Um, she included some of her songs from Alicia Keys and words from President Obama. Held Saturday at Riverside Church in Harlem three months after Ruby D's passing. Um, the service included contributions from poet Sonia Sanchez, among others. Alicia Keys sang her song Superwoman, which she said was partly inspired by Ruby D. And in a letter from President Obama and First Lady Michelle, they praised D for helping to throw open the doors of opportunity. Obamas have said that their first date included the 1989 Spike Lee movie Do the Right Thing, in which Ruby D starred. Once again, she passed on June 11th in her home in Westchester County, New York, at the age of of 91. Epic, epic weekend. I suggest you uh, find out everything you heard or did not hear inside this trending topic. Head on over to v-103.com where you can not only listen to it in its entirety, you can uh, see my, ain't gonna be no naked pictures to be me, face, because I don't take them. More V103 next.